welcome friends today i will solve some more examples on solution of partial differential equation of the type pp plus qq equal to r known as lagrange's equations okay that example is y square plus z square divided by p sorry y square plus z square into p plus x into bracket y q minus z equal to 0 first i will convert the given equation into the standard form that is y square plus z square into p plus x y q is equal to minus x z i'll shift to the other side that will become plus x z now it is in the standard form now auxiliary equation for this is given by dx divided by coefficient of p y square plus z square dy divided by coefficient of q xy and dz divided by xz from these two must be equal to some constant k the ratios therefore considering any of the two which are integrable therefore i will consider last two first two is not possible because z i cannot cancel here and first third is not possible therefore last two i will consider consider dy divided by xy must be equal to dz divided by xz then both side x x cancels then on integration i am going to get it as integration of dy divided by y is equal to integration of dz divided by z that is log y equal to log z plus constant c i will take it as a log of c1 therefore using the properties of log if you are shifting the log z to the other side i will get log of y divided by z is equal to log of c1 therefore i can write it as y divided by z equal to c1 as a one solution first solution then second to second solution i have to calculate to find out the second solution how can i combine two more terms there is no possibilities therefore i will go for the choosing the multipliers if i multiply and add those the terms then i will get the right hand side is equal to zero therefore i will choose if i multiply x here x y square plus x z square and here if i multiply by y y square z square then and the third term by z i will get cancelled therefore choosing the multipliers let me choose multipliers choose multipliers as x minus y minus z therefore i will get x dx minus y dy here i will multiply next here also minus z dz is equal to k into i am multiplying the denominator also the same terms and doing the same adding that is x into y square plus z square minus x sorry minus y into xy second multiplier second multiplier and then minus z into xz what happens here k into xy square plus xz square minus xy square minus xz square then x square cancels therefore equal to 0 x dx minus y dy 
minus z dz is equal to 0. This is integrable now. Therefore, on integration, on integration, I am going to get it as x square divided by 2 minus y square divided by 2 minus z square divided by 2 is equal to constant of integration I will call it as c2 or I can write it as x square minus y square minus z square LC is 2 equal to 2c2 therefore general solution is given by general solution is given by f of first solution y divided by z comma x square minus y square minus z square is equal to 0 is my required solution of the PDE like that another example I would like to solve here okay friends let me solve another example that is mz minus ny p plus nx minus lz q is equal to lx minus my okay here it is again it is in the form of pp plus qq equal to r type then auxiliary equation is given by dx divided by mz minus ny dy divided by nx minus lz and dz divided by ly minus mx must be equal to some constant k in that ratio then if i choose any two of them then one of the variable is going to remain because the um, subtraction of the terms is there if it is multiplication of the terms then one of the terms i could have cancelled that's why i have to choose two set of multipliers here so that the denominator of addition will become equal to zero okay that's why let me choose multipliers x y z first choosing multipliers choosing multipliers x y z i am going to get it as x dx plus y dy plus z dz is equal to k into bracket multiply by x multiply by y and multiply by z from the third terms therefore x into mz minus ny plus y into nx minus lz plus z into ly minus mx simplify this k into it should be 0 like that you have to select the multipliers here okay therefore mxz minus nxy plus nxy minus lyz plus lyz minus mzx mxz minus mxz cancels minus nxy plus nxy cancels then minus lyz plus lyz cancels therefore it is equal to 0 0 into k that is x dx plus y dy plus z dz equal to 0 now on integration on integration I am going to get it as x square divided by 2 plus y square divided by 2 plus z square divided by 2 equal to some constant c1 or I can write it as x square plus y square plus z square equal to 2c1 is my first solution like that I have to select the second set of multipliers so that again numerator will become 0 I will select second set of multipliers as L, M and N choosing multipliers 
as L M N. I am going to get it as L D X plus M D Y plus N D Z is equal to the right hand side K into L into M Z minus N Y plus M into N X minus L Z plus n into l y minus m x okay then the right hand side must be equal to 0 k into l m z minus l n y plus m n x minus m l z plus n l y minus n m x L M Z M L Z plus and minus minus L N Y plus L N Y cancels M N X plus M N X minus M X is equal to zero. Therefore, L X L D X plus M D Y plus N D Z is equal to zero. This is integrable. On integration, we are going to get as L X plus M Y plus N Z is equal to some constant C2. This is my second solution. Therefore, combining the two solutions together will form a general solution. General solution F of X square plus Y square plus Z square comma L X plus M Y plus N Z equal to 0 is the required solution for the equations okay in next video let me solve two more examples on this and subscribe my channel for more updates thank you friends